we're going to create our own snowman that has come alive at night. The first thing you want to do is build the base and decide what his action pose is going to be. Is he playing ice hockey, sledding, running down the hill with his friends, or whatever it is you want him to be doing? So to build this base, we want to build the base of a snowman with a small circle, a medium circle, and a large circle. Then I fill those in with the side of my chalk. Rather than the tip of my chalk, this will create less dust and we'll fill it in eventually when we blend it in with our finger. Now we want to decide what side the light is coming from. That would be your moon. So I'm going to put my moon in the top right corner. Just another circle. You could make it a crescent moon if you want though. Now the side that is opposite of the moon is the side that's going to have the shadow. So for me that's going to be my left side. We're going to make the shadow instead of with black, just with a hint of blue. Because sometimes in the snow, it kind of looks blue in our shadows. And notice when I do my shadow, I'm doing it with the curve of the circle. That's going to help it look more like a sphere. We don't want the line to be straight across because that's going to make it look flat. So I'm just going a curve with the circle. It kind of looks like a crescent moon. If you want, you can give it a little more shadow and let it blend out with a lighter blue. And then just blend that out with your finger. And then the rest of it just gets blended white because it's on the light side. Some people like to have a little tiny bit of yellow on the bright side, you can do that if you want. Maybe just a little tint of it on the head. Just to show it's really close to that light. Maybe your moon has a little yellow in it. Alright, now I'm going to create the backdrop of what he's doing. So I'm going to make mine playing ice hockey, I think. So I'm going to make the ice rink. And again, I'm covering a large space, so I'm just quickly doing it with the side of my chalk. Then let it blend in with my fingers. Make sure to use clean fingers when you're doing it with white. Otherwise you might end up with some colors you didn't mean to. Get right up close. Alright, so if he's playing hockey, he needs a hockey stick. So I'm going to get my brown, draw him a stick. Then he should have a little stick arm to hold that stick. Maybe this arm we don't see all the way, it's hiding. Alright, blend it in so the chalk doesn't go away. Oh, maybe he's right by the puck. Alright, then we can add our details to our snowman too. So he needs to see. Give him a little carrot nose. Do you want any details on him like scarves or hat? Maybe it's Christmas time-ish, so we could put a little Santa hat on him. Blend it in. Anything you do, make sure you blend in. Right. Is there a scarf on him? Is he smiling or is he giving an angry face because he's playing? Or... Let's make him happy. He's happy he's playing. Right. Then maybe I think he could use a scarf. Makes them kind of fun. You might add more details to your background. Maybe it's currently snowing. I just make my snowflakes with a little X and then a plus sign through them. That's a quick way just to indicate it's snowing. Alright, then any other details you want to add are kind of up to you. But this is my snowman at night playing ice hockey.